Hi, tweeters. Well, you sent us your questions for Mariska Hargitay, and she's here to answer them. So first up, Jennifer tweeted, Mariska, was this season's premiere episode hard for you to do, or was or, or were you excited to try something so new? E, all of the above. Really? Um, this year was, uh, without a doubt, the most difficult, the most challenging um, the episode I was the most scared of. It was uh, uh, every day I woke up going, I don't know how I'm going to get through this. But in that way, fear is such a great thing because it, you know, I, I worked harder, I went deeper, I had to be brave. And does it um, pick up where it left off? It does. Uh. And uh, it was really scary for me as a person, as an actor, all of it, really. But you feel the fear and you do it anyway. So it ended up being the most uh, rewarding work. Uh, I've ever done in my life. Well, that's fantastic. Jamie Lynn asks, uh, okay, they're, they're using you in the third person. So what was her reaction, Mariska's reaction, when you first read the script of the season 15 premiere? I can't repeat what I said. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I said, holy shit, they're, <laughs> they're not playing. Um, wow. I Without was, giving too much away, obviously. Yeah, I was like... Um, Frightened, scared, uh, excited, uh, and then you come around. And you say, I "Bring it, baby! I'm ready." And you must have fantastic writers on that show. Amazing. And I always feel like they don't get enough credit. The they writers, right? are amazing. Okay, now they have. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Rosalind is tweeting. I'm thinking about becoming an actress. What good pointers could you give me? Oh. Don't do it. No, no. I say, you know what? I say, do do it. And I am so grateful uh, to my dad, again, um, to my parents, because um, in a climate, you know, I grew up in L.A., and a lot of people there, you know, wanted this entertainment capital of the world, right? And so many uh, young kids want to be actors. And I think that a lot of parents say, don't do it, do something else, be a doctor, do this, do that. And uh, my parents said, Mariska, great. If that's what you want to do, you know, be the best and work your Bodhi off and um, study and, and, you know, don't give up. And so to me, that was the greatest gift because and that's what you would tell her. I would right? say, don't give up, never stop learning, read every book, go to acting class, get a thick skin. I know because I know you've talked about oh. rejection and oh how my people gosh. thought you were too short or too everything, too tall, too short, too. You know, plain to to this, to light, too, too exotic, dark, to, right? Yeah. I mean, you can't. That you can't. Too thin, too heavy, to everything. Everything they say, and you just go, okay, get a nose job. <laughs> that was a fun one. I said, you get a nose yeah. job. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would want to mess this with This guy you. told me to get a nose job and change your name. He said, I said, you change your name and get a nose job. <laughs> so, By the way, you have a great nose. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Cute. I mean, maybe from the front, not so much, but from the side, it's okay. Anyway, I love your nose. I was so annoyed by it even back in the day. And so that's why I think he, my dad said, don't give up. It's one guy's opinion. Everyone has one. That's right. They're like, you know so what? Persevere. Okay. Don't, don't quit. A tweeter named SBU Benson. I actually <laughs> like that Twitter name. <laughs> she wants to know. Oh, I think it's a she. Are there any television shows you'd love to appear on? If so, which ones? Other than this, obviously. <laughs> Katie, <laughs> um, you know, I feel uh, unequipped to uh, answer that question because I have 72 children, and so I don't have time to watch TV. Now, the one show I did want to be on that came and went, uh, my favorite show was the Ricky Gervais extras show, uh -huh. and they didn't, wouldn't, they didn't, didn't want ask you. me. And I'd love to be on SNL, but they don't want me either. I think they should have you on SNL. Me too. Fantastic. <laughs> Let's call Lauren Michaels. Call Lauren Michaels. Get Lauren on the phone. Stop. Come on, guys. All right. Okay, Jen Everyone asks. thinks I'm just a sex detective. <laughs> I'm not, people. She's so much more. Jen asks, is Benson ever going to get her happily ever after ever? You know what? That's a great question. I'd and like that. a great that. question this year. And something that I'm very excited about, again, which brings me back to why I'm so excited about season 15, is that um, Benson goes through the fire. But what happens when we go through the fire and we do the work? We come out of it. And we find joy and possibility and light. So I think that's where this season might end. Mm.
Sounds like a little man candy in <laughs> Benson's future. Well, if that's how you see it. <laughs> okay. Miss Ola just got engaged. <laughs> all right. All right. Thank you for answering those Twitter questions. For all of you at home on Twitter, visit katiecouric.com to find out when and where to watch Marishka here on Katie.